very happy I got that. Oh, Jesus, where am I? That wasn't awful. That was decent. Okay, well, let's see what was different in that. Um, two obvious things is I got the quick cube, uh, second cube, and I got I got the super octagon, the quick super octagon. Except that could have been improved by around half a second if I did the the second part right. I haven't. I haven't practiced jumping from the uh, the little rotating rectangular prism to the goal at all, so I was just kind of improvising there. Um, but that saved that can save five seconds straight up, as you can see in these splits. Um, I I really failed on the pillar. That's thirteen seconds. This would have been, yeah, this would have been a new personal best if I didn't fuck up on the pillar quite so hard. Um, relativity, just two seconds of just bad movement because I'm super rusty. Power reserves, I just used a more consistent strat. And I did, I did optimize the route just a little bit from what I've done before. Uh, floor is lava, yeah, just rust. Earth and sky was rust. The climb, I could have gotten, I could have improved half of a second there. Um, the tower was really nice. It, that was pretty good. Long jump, that was the best I've ever done the long jump. It shows, there. there's multiple ways. It's really hard if you know what you're doing to mess up on the long jump. I've, I'm beginning to figure that out. You just have to angle the perspective a few different ways, and depending on where you are on the corner, uh, that first corner that you have to skip past, it changes how close you need to be to that to that corner to make it uh, make him jump to the ceiling. Um, compression artifact. Yeah, I could have saved time there if I got the uh, the first cycle of that, that spinning red rectangle. If you angle it right, you can just walk right under it. There is another skip that I just don't like. There, I don't think it saves enough time to just 
do it. I mean, I might end up doing it for the second compression artifact, but probably not. Maybe I might learn it. Which really, well, I'll learn it fast. I can already do it. It's really easy. You can see in the thread. Um, population chamber. I can save. I can save more time there because I messed up lining it up perfectly. I could have just sprinted right into the perfect spot, and I've done it before. Ventilation room. Um, perfectly, except for getting in there. I walked forward after the population chamber. And I should have sprinted forward. That costed me a second. Um. Yeah, Super Octagon, I did that. I'm really proud of that one. The machine I messed up because I uh, unfroze the little guy a little bit too quickly. So I can get past that one column. Uh, my beginning was really good. I practiced that a lot. Uh, Wallflower, I'm still disappointed. And that about wraps it up for this run. Um, I will be putting up better videos of hopefully a personal best, but I just wanted to get this run out there. It has most of the standard uh, newer stuff that I've been able to find. I'm sure there might be better things, but uh, once I get the to get all the kinks out of this one and stop doing stupid mistakes uh, like I did in the pillar, I will easily I pretty easily get sub 8:30. Um, I'm looking for sub 8:20 as very ideal. I don't know. Uh, they'd have to have new glitches or new skips to do other things, but for now this is just the standard uh, run. And that's about it. I will be posting videos hopefully sooner. I've had to change resolutions. I haven't been able to stream uh, recently due to some technical issues, but I will be streaming a lot more uh, on my Twitch chat, which is just uh, my username up without the thaw, so it's twitch.tv slash kamail, C-A-M-A-I-L, and I hope to be getting this run optimized really soon. I have a lot more time. And that's it, so I guess I'll see you next time when these splits are a bit greener.